guys, it's Jessie here, back with another video. As you can see, I'm in a different location today. Um, it's I really wanted to film today, but it's practically pitch dark outside. Very overcast and dreary, so I wanted to try to get a little bit better lighting. And to also show off some of my fall decorations. I don't know how well you can see them, but uh, got my bar behind me all decked out for fall. So I thought I'd include that, because it's very appropriate for this video which is the I Heart Fall tag. This tag is a couple of years old, um, but I don't believe I ever did it before, and it's obviously still relevant. I do love fall. No one tagged me, but just felt like it was something fun, and I didn't require the best lighting in the world to be able to film this video for you, so that's kind of why I picked it. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this. I've got all the questions written out here on my phone, so if you see me looking down, that's what I'm looking at. I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it. So the first question is favorite fall lip product. And I just brought one out to share with you. I'm thinking about doing an entire video on my favorite lip colors for fall. So I didn't really want to give it all away. But the one that I brought out to share with you is one of the Revlon Lip Butters. This is in the color Sugar Plum. And it's just a really pretty kind of plummy tone that's not super bright but not super dark. So it's very wearable what I'm wearing today and I just really really like it I think it's pretty for fall very moisturizing so that's the one that I chose to share with you and look out for that video where I will be showing you this and all of my other favorite lip products for fall the second question is favorite fall nail polish once again I'm planning on doing an entire video on my favorite fall nail polishes you guys are gonna see a bunch of videos back to back to back that are all fall themed because fall is my favorite time of year. Um, but I, again, I brought one out to share with you. This is a polish from Zoya. This is Channing. And just look at that. That is the perfect fall color, don't you think? It's just a really warm, orangey copper color with tons of gold sparkle. So this is absolutely beautiful. I think it's what I'm going to put on my nails next. Um, I love Zoya polishes and I love this color. Question number three is, favorite Starbucks fall drink? Nope, I'm not a Starbucks person. I don't like them, I think they're overpriced. Just not my cup of tea. But I do love Tim Hortons, which is my coffee house of choice. And I love their um, coffee in general, with just with a pumpkin shot. I really like their pumpkin pie lattes and pumpkin spice things there as well, but I think sometimes it's a little bit overkill. I know their pumpkin pie ice cap, which I got, I really liked, but it's got like chunks of pumpkin pie crust, like uh, gin gingerbread graham cracker in there, and I wasn't crazy about that. So what I really like to do is just get an ice cap or just a plain coffee with cream and a pumpkin shot. Really, really good. Their pumpkin flavor is amazing. The next question on this list is a favorite fall candle. I've already done a whole video on my favorite fall scented wax cubes, so I will link that down below so that you can check it out. I just brought one to share with you. This is the Better Homes and Gardens Green Apple. It's what I have been burning all week. I love this. It's perfect for fall. It's just that nice apple scent. And I talked more about this and all of my other fall favorites in that video. So again, check it out. I'll link it down below. Favorite fall scarf or accessory? I have a couple of scarves, but I don't really wear them a ton because I feel like a lot of times they look weird on me or they don't lay flat or they bug me being around my neck. So while I do have a couple, I'm not going to share with you a scarf today. I'm going to share with you my favorite pair of boots for fall. These are so cute. They are kind of a mid range height, so they're not super tall like riding boots, but they're not booties either. They're right there in the middle. These I picked up last fall from Just Fab. These are the Dustin boots. And I just love the detailing with the buckle and how comfortable they are. They look really cute. This part here is kind of open, so it's a little bit floppy. Just really like the way that these look. And they got the perfect height heel. I love these. I wear them all the time. So I thought I'd share those with you. I don't know if you can still buy those or not. If you can, I will try and find them and link them down below for you. Otherwise, maybe I'll find something similar. I like to do that in my videos. If I'm showing off a certain thing and I can't find that specific item, I like to look for something similar to share with you guys so you can still get your hands on something if you're interested in it. It says, 
haunted house, haunted hayride, or haunted corn maze. I went to a corn maze last fall and I loved it. I think a haunted corn maze would be so cool, so different and unique. I think I would love that. Um, something about getting lost and being scared and all of that I think would just be awesome. So definitely think that that would be cool. The only one of those things I've actually been to is a haunted house, so I don't know. I just think that the haunted corn maze would be awesome. Favorite fall movie, obviously, without a doubt, would be Hocus Pocus. Um, I watch that every year around this time of year. In fact, I haven't watched it yet. I might just watch that tonight with my family. It's my all-time favorite. I love that movie. It's got a great cast. The storyline's amazing, and it's just perfect fall Halloween family movie. Love it. Favorite candy to eat on Halloween? Obviously, candy corn. I love candy corn. Anything pumpkin shaped is fun. I love the pumpkin shaped Reese cups. So, so good. I'm not a big fan of like really sugary candy like sprees and that sort of thing. Um, just give me all the chocolate and give me all the candy corn and I'm a happy girl. What are you dressing up as for Halloween? I'm going to be an angel this year. Uh, every year we go to a costume party. It's my husband's cousin's birthday and she loves to throw a costume party. Um, it's just fun. My husband and I generally tend to do couples costumes. Yes, we're that cheesy couple. Uh, this year we are going as an angel and a demon, and my costume is really, really simple this year. I actually went to Salvation Army and bought a graduation gown that's white, and I'm going to wear that with some wings and call it done. We did generally tend to go all out for costumes, but we just wanted to scale back this year and not spend a ton of money, so that's what we decided to do. And I will do a video on my Halloween costume, kind of an outfit of the day if you want to. That party is this weekend, so if you're interested in seeing that, let me know. And the very last question is, what is your favorite thing about fall? So many things. I love fall. I said it's my favorite time of year. I love when the weather starts to cool down and you get that crisp feeling in the air. I love the way that the leaves look when they're changing colors, all that orange and brown and red. Just so pretty. I love pumpkin spice everything, so love that about it. Thanksgiving is in the fall and it's my favorite holiday. I love a day where we celebrate being thankful because there's so many things in this world that I'm thankful for and having a day just to celebrate those things makes me incredibly happy. So yeah, I love fall. Hopefully you guys love fall and you're enjoying fall where you live. If you have not done this tag, I know it's an old tag, but if you haven't done it, or you want to do an updated version of it, I tag all of you to do it. Um, I, it's just really fun and I enjoyed it a lot. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about the background. Um, I know some of the stuff in the kitchen might be a bit distracting, but I think the lighting's a little bit better here and I love my little pumpkins and gourds peeking through in the background. So let me know what you think and subscribe if you haven't done so already because I'd love to have you back and I'll talk to you guys again soon. Bye everyone.